Hello, this is Dave Worthen. Today's mini-seminar is not really a seminar, but a reminder that in the current environment, your basic integrity and decency will be tested. This talk is entitled, Your Core Decency and Honor. Okay, so sometimes in this environment, you will find yourself confronting the quote-unquote crazy. The crazy will be certain people and events that will stretch your own personal reality and, yes, offend your core decency. The actual virus that is more destructive than anything biological is the virus that enters your mind and seeks to destroy this core decency. You will be challenged. Your integrity will be called into question even amongst your own peers and the philosophies you believe in. Every being on this planet has in their makeup this core decency. But where you see it missing in your fellow man, it is only where this virus has attached itself to the host and they have become the very thing they resisted. If you're watching this video, I'm betting you don't have, and possibly have never had, the biological virus. But you may have had, if you're honest, moments where you've gotten mad as a hornet at the insanities you're confronted with in your environment, and rightfully so. Possibly you've had to suppress or inhibit your own personal beliefs or emotions with your employer or someone who was acting completely insane at your local grocery store. You shudder at the insanity, and rightfully so. You witness the virus wreak its destruction by tearing away at the very fabric of the decency and goodwill of good people. The answer is not easy for even those of us who are strong. Viruses are not programmed to discern the weak or the strong. They are designed and programmed to destroy the host. When you feel under attack, it will not come from uneven breathing in your respiratory system. It will come from disturbing and alarming thoughts, emotions, and the utter insanity that is trying to take residence in your own mind and soul, and thus the decency of man. The antidote, however, is to never lose sight of your own core decency. Your fellow man may have fallen and momentarily lost his way as they cussed a blue streak at you for letting your mask slip down below your nose. But stay strong. This mind-numbing, misguided virus does not contain the code to break the human spirit, as there is no such code. It only attaches itself to fear. And that is the last bastion between it and your core decency. The derivation of the word decent comes from Latin decent, st the stem of decens, fitting, akin to decus, honor. Yeah, that's right. It's your decency and honor on the other side of that wall it's trying to break through. So maintain your decency in the presence of those factors that have as their goal to break you. Uphold your honor. That, w that which is the best in man, his core decency, his basic goodness, will prevail because of people like you and me. And by doing so, we will give hope and a helping hand to millions across the world. And decency will see the daylight once again. Okay, that's my mini-seminar for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for stopping by.